All right, so what I'm doing here, I put the first rail out. Then I 90 degree angled this with the laser straight down three and a half inches spacing each one. Hopefully it's right. If math is in our favor, it will be. What I'll do now is just set it here. Right, maybe. So I could swear that it was fine. And then I'm gonna level it <laughs> and mark it. This is the Harbor Freight kit. I don't have the information in front of me. Storage containers. You have to buy the okay, 20 bin rail mount stackable parts storage is what this is. So I just need to, I've been looking at them. I just need somewhere to put sorted things. Turn it on. I want to go this way with it. These don't need to be up here. So we go up. Oh no, it means we're high. That's what she said. Zero degrees is what we're looking for. does not have to be perfect. That is not right. Mark through it, I guess. Well, 
alternative, we you could just laser the But it's gonna work better. Maybe this way. Because it can pivot way better. Okay, so. This way. You can just estimate it with the top ones. First of all, level it with the marks you made. That's a bit better. Then draw. Make sure there's a line where the circle's gonna be. Because you're gonna come back through and marking that. Let's flip over. So we're going to put some holes in because this is just too much at this point. Actually, outside holes first. Just in case I run out. Sizes. I'd have to drill that hole more. That one I will. That one I will. If I can get it back out, that's what she said. Come on.
so. I knew it was eight of them. So I definitely won't have enough. Get a few more supports in. Then, see how many I have left. I mean, I could count them all, but I'd rather just make progress. So after that, there's one more row. size these up. I thought that was my shipment for a minute. It's semi-truck for a minute. Let's see. Let's see if it's a smaller one. My eyes fucking bother me so much. I hate it. Pretty sure this is gonna be not it. What? Oh, it's good enough. Couple of them up top. Not tender, but I think it's close enough. Ooh, is that close? 
little too much for me. And I don't know what it is. Literally just went to the eye doctor. don't have spare. Well, I mean, I could make one. What's funny is, right here I can see that it's angled, but the spacing is the same. This one, it's because the plastic bows in the center. Use the yellow side, it's softer. 
three, I saw right. Four. That is definitely four. Since I'm ahead right now, I'd rather not be thinking about it. Just family issues. Pushes it up or down. Okay, so which method is preferred? I'm actually going to measure. That is my preferred method right now. top of the rail. So, time like this, we need to be in here. We'll be where you want to be.
screws borderline overheating here on the camera but we are done let me try this is what we've got and it is done we just have to mount the rest of them There could be a lot better of the system. But for twenty dollars was it? It's organization, which is why I got it. So for me it works. We've got room to space them and whatnot. does not look the best without it being perfectly square but it being plastic and cheap even if you got all the screws perfectly squared you may still have some warpage from the plastic itself but that works for what I need just to be able to throw bolts, screws, nuts, or whatever into. And I'm probably going to try to label them. 